Welcome to the Lottie Files for Figma certification program. In this nine part video series, you're gonna learn how to master the creation of Lottie Files inside of the Figma platform. And at the end, you'll also be able to take a quiz and earn a certificate of completion so you can brag about it on all of your socials. Let's dive into our very first video. In this first lesson, I'm gonna help you get up and running with the Lottie Files plugin and give you the scoop on everything that this amazing little plugin can do. So first things first, let's get the plugin up and running right here inside of Figma. To do that, there's a couple of different ways you can go about it. You can hit Command or Control K on your keyboard. That opens up your quick actions, or you just hit that button down there on the bottom. Let's go past the assets over to the plugins and widgets, and this is where we'll do a quick search for Lottie Files we find the plugin that we're looking for, we open it up and we can get tons of great information on it. We can run it right away, but I know I'm going to be using this plugin a lot. So I'm going to go ahead and save this plugin so it's very easy to find in the future. When I click on it, that runs the plugin and that's it. We got the entire thing set up. We're now ready to discover all of the amazing features inside of the plugin itself. First up, let's talk about the Discover tab. This is a treasure trove of free animations. Simply find one that you like. I really enjoy this walking dog. I think he's super cute and perfect for my project. We can change the color palette to him if we want. We can also insert him directly into our project as an SVG or as an animated GIF simply by clicking here. I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Now we have access to the SVG version. That looks great. And also, if I want to save this to my workspace to use it for later, I simply select right here, choose which workspace I want to save him to, and go ahead and click that Save button. Your animations are always available to you in the Lottie Files online platform, and I can continue to edit them, maintain them, download them, and work with them at a later date. Now, here's something really cool, the Export to Lottie tab. With just a few clicks, you can whip up a Lottie animation straight from your Figma file. Want to know a little bit more about this? Stay tuned for some of the next videos. We'll talk all about it. Lastly, we have the tools panel and these are some powerful tools. First up, we have the AI prompt to vector tool. We can actually place in our prompt, choose a style, and then we can generate a vector. If you need to convert a raster graphic into a vector, Lottie's got your back as well. Just click right here, browse to find that image on your machine, upload it, and you got yourself a vector. And lastly, you can import a Lottie animation that you've already been working with. You can click right here and either open the animation from a URL or you can browse on your machine and drag that thing right in. It's your choice. Easy peasy. In this 30 minute hands on course, you'll learn how to create fun and intuitive animations that delight and guide your users, help tell a story, highlight important elements within your website or app and even boost conversions. Join millions of designers who have transformed their work with the power of motion. Elevate your designs, enhance user experiences, and make your projects stand out. Sign up for the Lottie Files for Figma certification today and learn how to make your designs not just functional, but unforgettable.